Carbon engineering is turning air into fuel. The company's direct air capture technology employs a proprietary process that allows its plants to capture and then use the carbon dioxide previously emitted into the Earth's atmosphere. The air in our atmosphere contains about 400 parts per million of carbon dioxide. At this 0.04% level, CO2 creates a problem for the global climate, but not a useful resource. Carbon Engineering's plants transform this challenge into an opportunity. The company's DAC plants take in air, which then reacts with a liquid solution inside a patented air contactor to absorb roughly three quarters of the atmospheric CO2. This solution is piped into a reaction vessel where it's mixed with another chemical to form calcium carbonate pellets. Once the carbon has been consolidated into these pellets, they are then heated to temperatures where they break down and release the carbon dioxide, which can then be captured as a gas, but now at 100% concentration. This stage of the process depends on using energy to generate heat. Ideally, this energy is both clean and renewable. However, if fossil energy is employed, these technologies are capable of co-capturing any additional CO2 created in this process. In this fashion, all the chemicals used in capturing CO2 are recycled, allowing the plant to run in a continuous loop. What does CE do with this captured CO2? In a process called air to fuels, the CO2 is used to manufacture liquid transportation fuels. First, renewable electricity is used to split water into oxygen and hydrogen. The hydrogen and CO2 from the air are then recombined in a step called thermocatalysis to form hydrocarbon fuels like diesel or gasoline. When burned in a vehicle engine, the fuels simply return their CO2 to the atmosphere. These closed cycle fuels are poised to play a critical role in the battle against climate change. By displacing the world's fossil fuels, carbon engineering hopes to significantly reduce the emissions currently created by transportation. The direct air capture and air to fuels technologies detailed in this video are currently being demonstrated at CE's headquarters in Squamish, British Columbia. By the conclusion of 2017, the company will have fully demonstrated the liquid fuel production at pilot scale, and by 2020, Carbon Engineering will begin its commercial implementation of this disruptive solution to the world's greatest challenge.